Angel Gardner slept on this sidewalk. Not the ideal spot for a teenage girl to grow up. But sometimes some of the world's ugliest places create the world's most beautiful art. If we name her, we can keep her. Bitch, blunt, damage, survivor. Palm she turns you toward a world that makes most of us turn away. Put your star-spangled shackles to my ankles and call me ignorant when I can't run from what's hunting me. Angel Gardner's poetry comes straight from the streets. Um, last winter was really, really cold. It was freezing. Like, it was, it was ridiculous to me. I'm like, we're outside in this weather. Taken away from her parents at age five because of abuse, she tries to count how many places she's lived. Ooh, I gotta think a little bit. I would say no more than 34. 34 homes in her 20 years on Earth. So we just kind of, you know, like chill here. Um, sometimes we chill underneath the bridge. She struggled with anxiety, anorexia, cutting herself. They'll become familiar with bridges authorities look under. But she could always escape. And I didn't really know if I had a talent, um, but when I was in a group home, I started doing this writer's group, and I just wrote. From the age of seven. My black did not bleed into your white. Your white dove head first into my ancestors' melanin. We're black. Friends at places like New Horizons Shelter in Seattle. And this is kind of like one of the bunks I used to stay in. They gave her an almost imperceptible nudge. And then everyone was like, oh, well, that actually kind of sounds good. I was like, like, good enough to keep doing it? They're like, yeah, you should keep doing it. She heard there was a prize for Seattle's Youth Poet Laureate. I heard you have a book deal. I want a book. I would love to do that. But there will always be a weed to wear out that cement. She won. Before this, I did have a lot of doubts about my writing. Like, people know I don't really like a lot of the stuff I write. But I think, like, after winning the Poet Laureate thing, I was like, oh, like, you're good. Like, you can accept that. You can, you can go with it. And go with it she has. Angels read her work in front of thousands, advocated on behalf of the homeless in the state capitol, and most important, she says she's forgiven her family so she can be a good mom for her four-month-old. I knew that was like where I was gonna come to sooner or later, because I always tell people, it takes so much energy to hold a grudge. For me, I write about a lot of deep, dark because I don't really write about happy-go-lucky It's not my thing. Demanding flowers. But and she does spot beauty in life's ugly. When the kids were told to make a home, bringing light to really dangerous or dark or depressing situations, but I guess the way I formed them, I wanted them to be seen as beautiful. I wanted them to be seen as art. And it worked. But I am made up from the strength, love, blood, and black of my ancestors. America will not change me.